My name is Jess Berry and I am an assistant professor of ophthalmology at Children's Hospital Los Angeles and the University of Southern California. What's the difference between retinoblastoma and uveal melanoma? So for many ocular oncologists, myself included, they are the two most common uh, tumors that we treat. That being said, they're very different. So both of them form on the inside of the eye. In general, there's nothing that you can see on the outside of the eye when you look at a patient with retinoblastoma or melanoma. Uh, retinoblastoma tends to form in children, so most often under two years of age, very rarely after five years of age. Uh, it is uh, similar to melanoma, known to have an underlying genetic mechanism, and it's something that can be passed down through generations. So if a family, if someone has retinoblastoma in both eyes, or sometimes even in one eye, but they have the genetic mutation in their body, they can actually pass that on to future children, and those children then are at risk of developing retinoblastoma. Um, parents tend to pick up retinoblastoma, usually through photos or in low light conditions when uh, the baby's eye dilates, the mom or the dad will notice a glow in the eye and that's actually the light from outside bouncing off the tumor on the inside of the eye. So retinoblastoma, tumor of children, uh, can be passed down through families and can affect one or both eyes. Versus melanoma tends to occur in adults, um, an older population, generally people with light hair and light skin, not exclusively, but generally. Again, underlying genetic mechanisms, rare to be passed down in families. It can happen, of course, but it is, it's pretty rare. Um, and additionally, it is also rare to have it in both eyes. It has been reported, but it is extremely rare, and again, generally in people who are predispos predisposed to that. Otherwise, it's in one eye. They're also treated very differently. So these children in general um, are treated with either systemic chemotherapy or chemotherapy uh, via the main artery that goes to the eye. Um, it's a long-term treatment that can go over many years and sometimes, unfortunately, even with treatment, the eye will need to subsequently be enucleated or removed if the tumor is not responsive. In melanoma, there are many ways to treat the tumor. A nucleation or that surgical removal is an option, um, but most centers around the world use um, radiation therapy of one form or another in order to treat these patients. So not external, but with a plaque on the outside of the eye or a proton beam treated, um, aimed at killing that tumor.